Hey's going guys, this is Twister and today I'm bringing you guys another GTA 5 video uh, continuing the fully upgraded car series for the Heist DLC and today we're going to be fully upgrading the Gang Burrito which is one of the ones I, I do apologise for not getting around to uh, fully upgrading for you guys but I have been uh, so uh, consumed by actually doing the Heist missions themselves uh, so we're going to go over, I think it's on Southern San Andreas, yeah there it is class gang breed so we're going to be buying this one we'll get it in orange for now because i'm going to be going for a cool orange paint scheme that i have actually done before but a lot of you guys might not have seen it and also uh, just a cool thing to note as i completed one of the heists i actually uh, spawned right in front of this uh, of this car when going back into free mode uh, which is uh, one of the rare fully upgraded cars that you can just find uh, in free mode so that's pretty cool i've just uh, i stole it from the npc that was driving it um, as I spawn back into free mode and I've just kept it in my garage since I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it I might just keep it um, just to kind of remember the fact that I managed to find that while it was full upgraded so that's pretty cool but anyway um, we are going to be waiting just for our D-class gang burrito gang van to spawn into our garage and then I'll be right back with you guys alright I am back with the gang burrito um, which is looking kind of cool it's already got the spoiler and uh, a few modifications already on it which I didn't realise um, but anyway before I do Again, to fully upgrading that, if you guys did miss any of my previous videos where I fully upgraded the Vapid Guardian, Insurgent, Casco and Armoured Kruma, I'll leave links to all four of those videos down in the description. Uh, and as usual with this video, uh, your support and your light ratings are always appreciated. So, let's take this into the customs. I've actually got a, a plan for the colour scheme. Um, I, was, um, I was debating whether to turn it into the colours of the, the A-Team van, if any of you guys know what that is. I thought that would be kind of a cool idea, but I think I'm just going to go with the nice orange slash red uh, pearlescent scheme that I've done in the past. I really, that is one of my favourites, I must say. Anyway, let's go into the um, go into the customs. And actually, it was tested by Bruffy when the when the DLC cars were released. It's tested. This is now actually the fastest van in the game. So if anyone, uh, if any of you guys actually do like to do van races, then this is going to be awesome for you guys. Uh, but anyway, let's get into a bit fully graded armor. Race brakes. Oh, you can change the color of these. All right, that's cool. You can. Oh wow, you can actually. Should we go for? I think I'm gonna actually go for the round ones. I'm gonna have it as my secondary color. Yeah, we'll have it as a secondary color. Bumpers. What do we got for bumpers? You can change. You can change these as well. So yeah, we'll go secondary color these. Engine. Full upgrade the engine. Exhaust. Wow, we got a lot of customization options already, which is really cool. We could have. I'm not too keen on side exhausts cars in this game, I like these uh, dual shotgun ones so we'll go for those um, leave explosives, so we got grill, what grill we got we'll do secondary colour grill horn I'll save a horn flay, I always like to choose a horn at some other point in time ok, neon layout, we'll go front, back and side and then for the actual colour we're going to go a nice orange so, right, I think we're going to get into the respray now, alright, so here we go so, I think, alright, I think I can remember what it is, I think the red is lava red should find it here, okay there we go lava red, as you can see it already looks quite cool but once you uh, go to pearlescence and you put a race yellow pearlescent on it it turns it into a really nice orange look there we go, race, oh race yellow, there we go, that's quite, that's looking cool already uh, and then for secondary colour, now there's a few things we could do with secondary colour, we could make it chrome but I think the chrome's a little too much we could make it metallic white, so if we go I think it's all the way at the bottom. Yeah, we can make it white, which I think the white looks quite cool. Or we could even do, which is something that I've been experimenting a little with, is like the brushed aluminium. I don't think gold suits it, but these ones look alright. But I think I'm going to go for metallic. I'm uh, going to go for metallic ice white. There we go. Um, Chrome, I'm not going to bother. Alright, roof. What we got for roof? Oh, wow, we can change this. I think I'm going to keep that the primary color. I don't think. I think, yeah, I think that was best as primary. Uh, we don't want to sell that. Spoiler. Oh, wow, you can have a double spoiler. That is epic. Alright, let's do let's do that, let's do that. Alright, suspension. How, whoa, this, this can actually go quite low. That is cool. Look at how low that thing drops to the floor. That is nice. Race transmission, turbo tuning, there we go. Wheels. Alright, so wheels, wheels, wheels. What should we do for this? Should we put some, like, badass muscle wheels on it? Now I'm thinking we go with some... Some badass muscle wheels. I think those are kind of the closest we get to the stock ones, which I actually quite like. 
So yeah, we'll go for that, why not? Uh, we don't want to have them chrome. We'll call, keep them as uh, the kind of orangey uh, colour to match the primary. Yeah, orange, I think that should do. We could do some now, we should do normal orange. And then obviously wheel accessories, we'll get custom, bulletproof, and then orange tyre smoke to match, and then finally, black out the windows, and damn, we have ourselves. We have ourselves a pimping gang, gang van right here. I'm loving this already. I knew there was a lot of modifications um, that you could do for it, but I wasn't expecting like to, for it to look this good when you do fully read it, which is awesome. Um, this is such a cool, cool vehicle. I'm probably, I probably actually will save this. Like when I do the fully grading videos, I usually fully grade them and then uh, for you guys on YouTube, and then decide whether I actually want to keep the vehicle or not. But I think this is definitely going to be my keep list. You can actually see the wheel clipping through the uh, the arches where the wheels are. That's quite funny. That is like just how low this vehicle is. But anyway, let's drive it back into the garage. Let's get a nice long look at this thing. I actually think that colour looks really well on this uh, burrito gang van. Definitely would recommend uh, you guys try this out because it looks so cool. Um, I'm still deciding whether to... Uh, to keep the Masacro and the Jesters, I might get rid of one of them because I already have a normal Masacro, um, but I'm not too sure. But anyway, off topic there. Here's the Gang Burrito. Let's go in first person. Get a nice look at that. There we go, looking awesome. So yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, as usual, like ratings are always appreciated. And if you are new to the channel, then definitely subscribe to keep keep up to date with more videos. And with that being said, I'll hopefully see you all in my next video. See you later, guys.